Okay, so what we're going to do with our 12-sided dice is I'm going to use the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 in this row, and then, and then 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 okay. in that row. Okay, and I'll do 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I'll mark with the orange. Well, we'll see if I can do that, actually. I have 12 cubes. All right, go ahead. Let's roll 12 times and just see what happens. All right, 8, so 7, 8. Actually, I said I'd mark the top ones with the orange, so might as well. One. One. Make sure you shake that dice up real good before you drop it in there. One. Three. Three. So how many blanks are we looking, hoping for, or thinking we're going to get? Four. Three, four blanks. Three or four. Twelve. Twelve. All right, so that goes there. Sorry, we're banging everything. Twelve again, wow. So we know we're going to have at least two blanks now. Okay, yeah, that's good reasoning. Four. Four. Five. 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 Three, that's at least three. Two. Alright, three more rolls. So how many blanks did we end up with? Five. Okay. Wow. <clears throat> Is that a surprise? That was around four. All right, so you thought it would be four. Okay, so tell you what, we don't have to do it on camera, but let's do this 12-sided die one more time, and we'll do it off camera, and then we'll just turn the camera back on and talk about it, okay? Okay. Okay, so what we're going to do with our 12-sided dice is I'm going to use the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 in this row, and then, and then 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 okay. in that row, okay? And I'll do 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I'll mark with the orange. Well, we'll see if I can do that, actually. I have 12 cubes. All right, go ahead. Let's roll 12 times and just see what happens. All right, 8, so 7, 8. Actually, I said I'd mark the top ones with the orange, so might as well. One. One. Make sure you shake that dice up real good before you drop it in there. One. One. Three. Three. So how many blanks are we looking, hoping for? Or thinking we're going to get? Four. Four. Three, four blanks. Three or four. Twelve. Twelve. All right, so that goes there. Sorry, we're banging everything. Twelve again, wow. So we know we're going to have at least two blanks now. Okay, yeah, that's good reasoning. Four. Four. Two. Three. That's at least three. Two. Alright, three more rolls. So how many blanks did we end up with? Five. Okay. Wow. <clears throat> Is that a surprise? That was around four. All right, so you thought it would be four. Okay, so tell you what, we don't have to do it on camera, but let's do this 12-sided die one more time, and we'll do it off camera, and then we'll just turn the camera back on and talk about it, okay? Okay. Okay, so we did it again, and uh, how many blanks did we get this time? It was six blanks. Six blanks, wow, so our, our rolls really clustered this time. We actually got four nines, three tens, and two fives. Okay, so tell me about what you think about what's, what's going on when we roll an n-sided dice n times. Why don't, first of all, why don't I see all the numbers? I mean, it's got, like our six-sided dice had six sides, and I'm rolling it six times. Shouldn't I see all the numbers? Well, I mean, it's random. So just because you've rolled a number doesn't mean you can't roll the number again, because you've... Each number has an equal chance of coming up. Okay. So you, 
it's unlikely that you're going to see all the numbers. Because no if gaps. you've like rolled five of the numbers already, then you have a five. You have only a, a one sixth chance of seeing the number that you haven't have, and you have a five sixth chance that you're going to see a number that you already have. So it's kind of the chance is greater when you roll more numbers. The chance gets greater that you'll see another number that you have. Interesting. Okay. And what do you think? Um, what do you think it is? Is anything different with a twelve sided dice? Well, it's just like rolling two six-sided die and adding up the total. Kind of similar. Similar? Okay. All right, well now we're going to go to the experiment uh, that, that um, uh, was suggested on Twitter. Okay. And we're going to do it with the whole chessboard. And so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use Mathematica to pick 64 random numbers. And we're going to go mark those 64 numbers on the chessboard. So now, how many blanks do you think we're going to have? I'm going to say maybe around 16. That's around a fourth. Okay, so you think it's going to be I'm 16. I'm going to say 16 to 21. Okay. That's about a fourth. It's a fourth to about a third. Okay, so why, why are you thinking it's, we're going to see a fourth? Well, I mean, we've kind of seen that here, and we've sort of seen that in the six-sided dice as well. Okay. All right, cool. Well, we're going to first, the first thing we're going to do is have to count out 64 snap cubes. I already have 12. And then we'll go through the list of numbers, okay? Okay.